Hi, beautiful. How are you doing today? So... Wait, am I in? Am I in the frame? <laughs> am I in the frame? So Eric and I have some exciting news. Very exciting. We're having twins. <laughs> Each of us is having one of the twins. <laughs> it's a new thing. It's, it's new. It's 2019. So Anything's so possible funny. in 2019. <laughs> No, okay, so really though, um, Eric and I have a new channel. A new channel. A new channel. Wait, what did you say? A new channel. A new channel. I'm so excited. It's called Brad and Eric, and it is linked below. Please subscribe. The trailer will be out this coming Friday, so make sure you check it out. It's it's pretty epic. We've been filming for a long time for this new channel, and we are showing a lot of behind the scenes, a lot of what you guys don't see. A um, lot of drama that like... A lot of drama <laughs> that we weren't expecting. <laughs> a lot of just our daily life that is actually kind of in we're kind of interested. <laughs> Surprisingly enough, there's a lot of stuff that goes on and it's kind of crazy. It's kind a lot of, of fun. Interesting. So go subscribe, get ready for the trailer on Friday and we are so excited to so watch. So pumped. It's gonna be so fun. It's gonna be amazing. I can't um, wait for you guys to see it. And if you want to support us, then thank you. And if not, no hard feelings. Thanks for that too. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Eric. It's time for you to get out of here. Peace. We'll see you on the Brad and Eric channel. <laughs> So today is your favorite kind of day. It's America's Next Top Model, or just a reacts video day. I happened to find another episode that I haven't watched yet. It's actually season two, so we're going way back, and it's gonna be quite entertaining because clearly the makeovers are gonna be very outdated. This aired in 2004. Holy crap, that was 15 years ago? What? This aired 15 years ago. So yeah, expect some really outdated makeovers and expect to be entertained. All right, you guys, let's watch America's Next Top Model season two makeovers. Let's do it. Tyra Mill used to be so lame. Like, where is the Tyra Mill moment? Like, hello, where did it, what happened to that? I need that in my life. <laughs> it's hot! Warren Tricomi. I almost worked there. And this is so old school. I love it. Wait, Tyra Tricomi. looks really and good. Tricomi and this is Warren. Joel oh. Warren. They are going to Call take me. you from ordinary to extraordinary. We also have Jay Manuel here, who, you know, beats my face and makes me love He's so hot. 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 One hundred percent. They maybe I think secretly the reason why I'm always blonde, <laughs> like I'm obsessed with blondes, is because of Jay Manuel. Because he really started that blonde game. He really revolutionized the white hair, the silver hair, the gray hair. Listen, he really started it. You think it was somebody else? No, it was him. It was Jay who started the silver hair trend in two thousand and three, or even before that. He has been doing it for forever. Whoever his stylist is, props to you, man. You killed it. Beats my face. It makes me look lovely for my photo shoots and personal appearances. Do it yourself. He does makeup, too. Really honest with you. It looks like we need the makeup police here today. So you don't need to have a crew. Okay, this hair was really good for Tyra. Also, since when is Jay a makeup artist? <laughs> Literally, his title said art director of shoots or something like that. No budget for this season. <laughs> this is not just an ordinary makeover. I'm taking it to the next level. Miss Katie, you are very reminiscent of Twiggy to me. So we are chopping for sure off. I love a big chop. Joanna, a modern mohawk. Oh, cool. Literally what my reaction would have been. Like, oh, you're gonna give me a mohawk. <laughs> it's so sweet of you. F*** <laughs> you. Mercedes, we're gonna add some extensions to your hair and make it really big and wild and kind of animalistic. Sinatra, I remember you her. are 5'7". Your hair is too long for that height. Yes. We're going to take you from here to... Oh Ms. my god, Shandy. Shandy. Brown hair. I remember her. Like I'm stalking the shelf at Walgreens. <laughs> we are going to make you a platinum blonde. <laughs> that one's going to look so good. Oh, these makeovers are actually great. Also, Seemingly. You are going to be getting some contact 
some contacts. We're going to make you a little bit more blonde. <coughs> All the other girls, they got her totally... <laughs> Me. Every other season, they would have been like, oh, thank God, they're not changing my hair. Tyra's like, we're gonna make you a little bit more blonde. Like, that's a compliment. Like, she looks good. Oh my God, those were some ratchet foils. <laughs> Somebody needs to learn how to fold foils. He can still be a good hairstylist, not about fold foils, but good foils is just a pet peeve of mine, you know? I just love a nice, crisp, beautifully folded foil. It just shows your craftsmanship. Not everybody's cup of tea, I guess. Oh, they're doing bleached eyebrows on her. Yeah! <laughs> that is the rudest thing to say somebody who just cut all their hair off and got a mohawk because you told them to. You look very rooster. Tyra, off. <laughs> just kidding, I love you, Tyra. Look at the pencil thin eyebrows. She's so pretty. Oh, her hair looks so good. I love it. I can do peacock hair, classic. Oh my god, it looks so much better. Her hair short is like, you look like a model now. Like, that was healthy for you. The haircut they said was because it makes me look taller. Yeah, they played the tall card with me again. Girl, she looks way better with short hair. So far, two for two. The, both of these makeovers look really, really good. For 2004, these are actually more up to date than the current season makeovers look. Like the current makeovers, they're doing like some weird stuff and these ones actually look really, really nice. This is complaining about everything. We get hair color cut and everything is being done This is when Eric gets his hair color done by me. He's like, it hurts so bad. I'm like, shut up. I love it. I love it. Wow, 2004, and that honestly looks like it could have been done today. Like, those blended, beautiful highlights. They were really ahead of their time at Warren Tricomi. Like, I am thoroughly impressed. Her hair looks stunning. To me, it's therapeutic. I feel very sexy. With the after. She looked so much younger. That dark color with her skin tone just makes her look more alive and vibrant and healthy. She looks so much more like a model now. I mean, that was really, all of these are really good. Like thoroughly impressed again. Like, whoa, love it. what's happening? I love it. They really didn't focus much on the makeovers though in this season. Okay, even her color. What is this? How is that so, I need to go to war and Jacomi. like sh you're very much ahead of your time there. Wow, uh, her hair color looks so beautiful and so up to date and there is not one stripe on her head. It is blended to perfection. Oh my God, she looks so much more like a model now. Katie's obviously 18. Sometimes she'll be a little more sophomoric than the rest of us. Sophomoric. Definitely scared right now. Uh, she looks so good. Holy crap, that was the best makeover. Like, I get it, she's freaking out. Like, obviously, if you got that much hair cut off in one little sitting and you didn't even know what was happening until that morning, you would be freaking out a little bit too, probably. But she looks so good. Like, way more like a model. She stands out from the rest of the pack now. She looks incredible. worse at making people feel better like yeah it looks a little bit yeah it looks a little bad right now like fuck you trust me, okay? it's a weird haircut but i, I kind of like it i'm just kind of worried about my hair because i didn't have any kind of change that i mean the end. it looks can, good like, hey you haven't had any kind of change i love the color i love everything to take this to a smoky eye we take a little black shadow oh and then she I'll looks then so hot I love the bangs on that girl though. They were they looked great. My new look is very curly, very sexy. I have to work on being sexy because I'm not. She could have got a little bit more, I think. I mean, I really like it. I really liked the hair, but maybe they could have done a little bit crazier of a look. I don't know, but she looks hot. She looks hot. Oh, it's pretty. I like my look. It's vibrant and sexy. Oh. These were the best makeovers of any season. 
And I, how did it take me this long to, to do this? Whoa, she looks incredible. I wish that they put a few more highlights in her hair just to bring out that curl a little bit, but wow, she looks hot and her makeup looks stunning. But like, obviously Jay slayed it. Like, Jay Manuel slayed their makeup, duh. Everything just looks so good. Everything's come together and yeah, it looks so pretty. Oh! My God, it's great makeover after great makeover after great makeover. She looks like a model. She looks so much better. This hair is so good for her. The way it was colored is impeccable. In one day, in one sitting that they got it this light is amazing with no like with no orange undertones like it looks like a very professionally beautifully done color and Shandy looks stunning. Here we go. You're gonna be shocked when I come home. <laughs> Katie Why? hates her life right now. Is it short like boy short? <laughs> oh. You don't have to try. It has to be done for to further your career. What an asshole. Are you getting compliments on it? Yeah. I guess I just have to get used to. She looks so change. much better. Because models do that like every month. Yes, Katie. Yes. All right, let's fast forward now. I just want to see the final shots of like them actually in their shoots of that day after they got their makeovers. So let's go to the judging part and let's check out their photos to see how these makeovers look in photographs. You girls are gonna have Tyra to looks recreate incredible. a specific look reminiscent of a certain era. We have 50s glamour, 60s mod, 80s punk, a goth look, and a futuristic look. There are no reference photos here, ladies, so it's all up to how you interpret these looks. Okay, so they have to quickly put on <laughs> crazy makeup to show what they okay, learned Shandy during the makeovers. Shandy is Shandified. Oh, God. Yes. Yeah. That makeup looks so great. It's fierce. You committed to it, and it's a great this job. what Eric says to me every morning. Yes, you look fierce. And here is your best picture. <laughs> Why are they wearing like harnesses? Nobody could afford to Photoshop those harnesses out. In your eyes, it's really great. It looks like it. Yes, the new hair looks great. I think your makeup works really well with your hair. It's 80s, but it's not punk. I was a mom yeah. in the 80s. I don't remember makeup like that. Yeah, here's your best shot. Oh, cool. Wow, that's punk. It works for me in a cool and fun yes. way. Yes, the hair looks amazing. Things. What's your card? That works. That does work. I think it's really cool and different, but I still would have liked to see you prettify yourself just a little bit more. <laughs> she um, looks ridiculous. Yes, like she looks amazing in that photo. <laughs> 80s punk. I adore the Yes, she looks Here's great. She did a great job on her makeup. I spent a lot of time telling you how Work. to give me some intensity. You have to learn. Why are they hanging? It seems like a little dangerous to me, but how to become more conscious of your face. If you're selects, I don't her hair looks great. Shots. There should be she did a really good job on her makeup. I think your makeup's excellent. I think all you all were born in the 80s, so you're like feeling that era because that's the era that you came out your mama. Your hair is so 80s. Yeah. Wow, that's some hair. Here's your best picture. Wow. Like the hair is body. so good. This looks like you're dangling 100 feet above the sky. Yeah, it's great. Oh, oh I like it. <laughs> this is Eric. This is futuristic. You look gorgeous. I love the intensity. She looks a foot taller. Yeah, it's great. This is futuristic. Wow. LSD makeup. Sorry. <laughs> this, is <laughs> a... <laughs> this is me on the weekend. If the two symbols are gone, this would definitely be in a high end fashion <laughs> editorial. What? This doesn't seem like it represents Camille. Oh, no, she looks bad. I'm trying photo. to get you to give me you know, energy, but I never got any she looks dead. intensity out of your poses. All right, April. You are futuristic. Love her bangs. The white just takes it away from your beauty. It doesn't, this makeup for yeah. me does not enhance your beauty. Whoa, I love it. Stunning. That. Damn, that's dope. It's really good. We had so many shots. It was very hard to choose, which is a That's what I'm talking about. All right, see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. You look neat. What are the cool names? See you I'm goth and they don't really talk much. I went to school with a lot of them. But this is <laughs> This choice should have had no boundaries. You take it all the way. She looks bad. Have mercy on my soul, child. I this don't like that. Cool. There's something that dust isn't connected. Oh, just these girls are soft. really not, <laughs> not very good. To you because he was comforting Katie. To me, that Katie's the prettiest, life, I'm and sorry. You're directing me right now and being here for every single frame can make me possibly be eliminated. I bet Katie's picture is going to be better than yours. <laughs> 
Because Katie was thinking about herself and you thinking about Katie. Yes, selfishness. I have a little word to say. No, 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 no. You realize, yes, Jay was sitting next to me for most of the part. The entire time, he never said a word to me. He was directing Siomara. As well, it was really confusing, it was really weird. Ah, I love it, and, and I was comforting you, and you were going up too, and you know that, and, and you know what I said to you. Well, I don't care what you guys said, we've done the set. Let's see the picture, please. We need to judge the photograph. Uh, uh, it's well, kind of fierce. It's, yes, yeah. it's much better than the other. In fact, it's it's quite fabulous. Oh, you here see, goes Katie crying know, again. Get over it. Shots. She only shot 12 frames. Oh my god, is she gonna faint? <gasps> so now it's oh my god, eight. I think she does faint. I remember this. After the judging, Katie just kind of got weak and faint. I thought it was hilarious. <laughs> Ten beautiful young ladies stand before me. But I only have nine, nine photos, photos in my hands. And these nine photos represent the nine of you that will continue on the journey towards it's becoming America's, America's next top model. Oh my god, who's gonna get eliminated? To your pictures, but I think it's gonna be Heather. Heather's gonna be eliminated. Say Mara. One thing that the judges don't understand is how you could let the attention that another girl is getting ruin your chances at winning this competition. <sighs> Whose ever name I do not call must immediately go back to the loft. Pack your bags. And pack your belongings. And leave. And leave. <laughs> I watch way too much America's Next Top Model. See you <laughs> Congratulations. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Good decision. You're still on the running towards becoming America's Next Top Oh, what a great show. <laughs> oh, well, guys, that was America's Next Step Model Makeover Season 2. I hope you uh, enjoyed that as much as I did. Don't forget to check out my new channel, Brad and Eric. Follow me on Instagram, BradMonoNYC, and follow my hair care line, XMono Hair, on Instagram. And thank you guys so much for watching today. Don't forget to live your extra life, and I will see you all next time. Peace!